Hi guys, it's Tamara here of Tamara Fashion Style and today in this video I'm going to teach you five things about the, um, the ruler that I purchased that you guys would want to know. So if you want to know about the five things about the ruler, stay tuned and keep watching. So this video is all about some rulers that I purchased online and I want to show you guys some things about the ruler and I want you guys to see how it look what is it and five things about it so as i said stay tuned and keep watching now subscribe to my channel leave me comment if you like this video give me a thumbs up follow me on instagram youtube facebook check out my blog at Tam tamara fashion style that web follow me on um tamara sewing with tamara think fit and on pinterest so if you want to see the five thing about this ruler keep watching so let's get started so guys this is my review and this is the box that um the rulers them come in you see it marked fragile so it's something very um thin very um it, it won't it can't take too much of shifting you have to get something like a ruler rack to put this ruler in so i open it already so um just to see what it look like so i'm gonna um we open it for you guys let you guys see now the ruler comes like this all right the ruler comes like this this is um all is rulers it comes like this but it they come packed very neat in package they come with like a plastic um package inside like a plastic bag cover them well neat and nice so this is the ruler what um it look like now this is a very this is i saw this um ruler online it's um the pattern grading ruler it um also come with like instruction like for you guys um to follow the instruction now i never use these rulers but i hoping to use it very soon because i do pattern drafting and i need to grade up some of my pattern to do some bigger size pattern in pdf so you have everything here about this rule. They give you the, the, the sleeve, the grading um, chart so you can see how to go about it. They give you the um, bodice grading. They give you the um, the skirt and they give you the pants. So everything and it go by colors. So um, this, if you want to grade up or grade down, you have the colors to choose from to grade up or down. So I really, really like this um this chart that they send and it also have the instruction over here so you can um follow the instruction and see what you have to do as i said i never use it as yet so i'm just doing a review right out of the box as i get it right so i purchased this on um st so this is what it look like now this one here as i said this is the the ruler i never use it this is the sleeve this is the sleeve rule right it have all the marking here all the marking here so all the color that is on here on this paper it's already here on the ruler so if you want to grade up or grade out if you want to grade down sorry or grade up you have all the colors right here you see all the colors here so you have all your colors right here and this is the sleeve one so it's teaching you how to grade your sleeve so i really really like this because you line it up with the green or the green line on the pattern and you can grade down to a, a smaller size or grade up to a bigger size so this is the sleeve um grading rule that i purchased from this company here so you can go on st and you can look for this um company tools fully grading ruler so i purchased this from tools fully so this is the sleeve as i said and it's very very nice it's very um thing but the only thing about it it kind of the, the material kind of a little um thin so um during shipping right it would have some issue doing shipping i will get to that but just let me go through the rule first so i find this is a very nice thing this person do um for help you grade your pattern if you want it smaller or larger 
I think this is a very smart idea this person come up with and I really really like it so this is the sleeve one and I will be using this soon next one I have is the pants now this is the pants grading rule how thoughtful of that person you know we always want to draft our own pants we always want to make our own pants but we scared or maybe we in that all uh, those talent or maybe the pants in come out gold or sometimes we cut it too small or too big now you have the grading rule right here to grade your pants up or down i really really like um like this idea of the grading or the pants so as i said everything is color code so you choose your color for whatever size you want to go up or go down and i didn't use it as yet so i just want to do a review out of the box so this is the pants for the ruler that it come in this is the top now i really was surprised to see that you get to draft top to you get to um to go up or down in your top and this is a princess seam top you have the dart in the the, the the neck you have the dart in the waist and every one of these ruler have the color code on them so this is a very nice ruler very very thoughtful of this person i really love how they um, really design this um, rule so that you can grade your pattern up or down. So I will be doing a lot of grading of pattern with this ruler. So if you guys like this ruler and liked it, I will put a link in the bottom where you can get this. So this is the top in it. And as you guys can see all the color, you can grade up to whatever size you want. All the colors is here. And I'll be using this a lot next we have is the skirt wow imagine you can grade your skirt up you can grade it down you can do whatever you want you can make whatever pattern you want with this so i have the skirt so the skirt is the same thing you have all the color code as i said as they bring in with the paper you have all the color code on the ruler so you can grade it to whatever size you want so now I'll be using this um, grading tools a lot. So this is the four that I have. I have the skirt, I have the top, I have the pants, and I have the sleeve. Now, this rule of very, very nice. It's very um, handy, I would say, for people who are doing a lot of pattern drafting. I find they should, this is a must have. Who want to um, like, grade the pattern to do it in pdf farm to sell it or so this is a must have and i purchased this from um st and i think they had four um rulers was for 64 dollars i think i think it's four ruler for 64 dollars because it come in a set so it's four rulers for 64 or 67 dollars one of the two can remember the full price but it come in a set and then you have the um downloadable um free body pants and you have the slopers you can download for free you get um you get it in the quarter scale you get it in the um large scale you get it in a half scale now i have some here i would like to show you what um what it look like i print out some of the um the quarter scale so I will show you guys what this quarter scale um, look like. So I have some of the quarter scale that I print out. So when you print out um, the quarter scale, you get your skirt pattern on a sheet like this. Now this is a small one because it's a quarter scale. And the reason why um, you could print out this quarter scale is like to practice your design. Right? Let's say you have a design that you want to... Um, copy a design or you want a pro to pro practice um a design you have this quarter scale you can work with so that was very thoughtful of the um designer for this ruler for give you the um quarter scale in the skirt you have it in the skirt they also give you the quarter scale um in the pants i have it in the pants as you guys can see this is uh, just a piece of the pants i didn't hook it up yet right but this is um the pants quarter scale as you 
put them together, you will see that they, because you have to get the pieces to match up. So I could work on the quarter scale design. Now the girl, they give you a quarter scale, they give you a half scale, and they give you a full scale. Now the full scale one, you have to carry it to a copy shop and let they print it out for you on a huge piece of paper so you can cut it out and work with it with this rule if you don't know how to draft um, part one. So I think I know to draft part one, but I will still go and um, copy, print out the big pattern to work with with these rules because I find it will be very more um very more organized very more neat very have all the measurement they have some with seam allowance some without seam allowance so you can work with these rules so then for instance let me just show you so let's say this is your skirt remember this is just a quarter scale you're working with and let's say this is your skirt right and you want to grid this skirt up all you have to do is find a green line on this um skirt can you remember the skirt have green and let's pretend this is the green line all you have to do is get your rule place your rule on the green line like this like that and they put they they, they send a puncher for you where you can punch it so it come with this little um puncher here there's a little puncher he send this with the little puncher here so all you have to do is remove this and let's pretend that this is the green line. So all you have to do, let's say you want to scale up or you want to scale down. So this is a size smaller. You just punch it like that. You want to go a size um, a little larger. You punch it like that. You punch it so like this. You do the same here. With the waist, if you want to go up, you come and you punch right here, here. Whatever color you choose, your color, I'm just um, doing it random. Punch it like that. And you just remove the ruler. You just remove it. And all we you see um, have the punch. You just get um, your ruler and you will just it's a little size bigger and you just come down same way to that you just come down now the size smaller you just come in like that I just freehand in this but you guys will do it better as I said I ain't lose the ruler yet and you just come in so that's what you get the size smaller and you come down so you grading down the smaller size this one is the smaller size that we grading down to and this one is the bigger size this come right back so just the hip we need to um to come in so I find that it, it, it was very nice. So you can grade your pattern very, very easy. Let's say you want a bigger size um, skirt. Let's pretend that this is the green line. Remember, we have a green line. We're supposed to have a green line. Let me just draw in the green line for you. So let's say this is the green line on the skirt. So you just place the ruler like this on the green line here and you do your um your drying on it so this is all about that but this that is for our next time just let me tell you a little about the ruler so i find it was very thoughtful so the ruler also come with this um pointed um tool here so i get this with it and i get the four, um, four ruler but um, the five things to expect during your shipping with this ruler. Number one, the ruler is a very helpful tool, right? For people who want to grade up and grade down the pattern, who want to do a PDF to sell. But always um, remember that um, the ruler is not too sturdy. It kind of, the material is a little thin, but it could work for what you want it to right it could work for what you wanted to just don't handle it um kind of rough if you know you're going to use this ruler when you finish 
pull them up very neat get a ruler rack and stand them up so that when you're ready you can pull it out very easy don't put it for lie down so that nothing could mash it don't put it in the way so that people can mash it or it can fall because the ruler can't take falling this is number one number two don't leave the ruler by nothing hot because leaving it by like your iron and these things, it can melt the ruler. As you can see, this is plastic. And don't press too heavy on the ruler. If you have it on a flat surface, it's okay. But don't hold it in your hand like this and try to bend it. And all these things, it can break. Number three, don't let your children play with the ruler. Don't let nobody who will know to handle this ruler play with it because it could break it's very fragile so the ruler can break don't let anybody play with it please put your ruler up in a safe place put it up in a safe place number four always take care of your take care of your ruler always take care of it when you finish using it wipe it down with a nice um tissue paper you get a piece of tissue um paper a nice piece of tissue clean it down always left your ruler clean so that when you come the next day you can have your ruler don't cut um wrong the edge with any sharp tool because it can give left a rough edge around the ruler and next thing don't put this ruler between your fabric and, and between your rest of the ruler and things like that because the ruler is very um, um, kind of soft, it's like a soft material. So take care of the ruler, get a wrap for it as I said and don't make it fall or anything. And number five, in shipment when the ruler came, <coughs> the ruler came, um, it, it kind of break, right? But that won't affect the use of the ruler because remember this is the end of the ruler. So you using the top area which is here. This part here comes very nice. But the ruler um in shipping, I guess is in shipping because the seller ship it to us and by its plastic, by the throwing of the box and all passing through all these shipment and these things, I guess is that what break the ends of the ruler. All the ends came break so um as you guys can see all the ends came break i have all the pieces in my box here as you guys can see i have all the pieces this is a piece from it i have all the pieces in the box it it came break i guess this is true shipping so i won't blame the seller for this i won't blame all the the, the ruler them break right here but i won't blame the seller because the seller ship it very very um very good but i guess it's true shipping the ruler break and this is the five thing about the ruler i want to tell you about so expect breakage of the ends just around the ends because the ruler everything okay the ruler except for the ends them break um break off some little piece break off the ends like this one here this end break off this one this one end break off so expect little things like breakage in the in in the ends of the ruler and the shipping was very quick i get these very quick the seller was um very nice the seller respond to your message quick 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 because I send the seller a message and the seller respond one time to my message. So go on ST. I will put the link below where you can get this ruler. And the seller is a very lovely seller and so on. So that's what I want to do a review on this um, rulers. Telling you that it's okay. You can go ahead and purchase them. Don't forget to purchase the ruler. The ruler them are very, very nice. I really, really like them. The only little thing is that you have to expect breakage in the ends when it come and you also get this tool with the ruler so as i said i ain't use it yet when um i use it i will do a review on them so this is the five thing about the ruler and as i said i will put a link below if you guys like this um ruler where you guys can get this ruler so this is all for now and i'll see you guys so this is all for now and i'll see you guys 
soon bye so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i really really looking forward for your comment if you guys like this video leave me a thumbs up leave me comment below subscribe to my channel so you won't miss any of my video that i pause and my review so i'll see you guys soon this is all for now bye bye